show you where it is, then look someplace else while you turn the key. I like Bobby already. Salieri might have been the big six when he was younger, but he's all washed up now. Mm -hmm. It's only a matter of time before Morello punches his ticket. Hey, hey, this is Nerion, and welcome back to another brand new episode of Mafia Definitive Edition. Um, yeah, so in the last episode, which was just the motel showdown, uh, <laughs> there was a showdown. Yeah, that was, uh, that was pretty, pretty fun, and, um... Now we have a mission. I don't know if you can see your current mission. Oh yeah, fair play. Talk to Ralph. Mikey Dunn can't lose the big race. Time for some sabotage. So, um, I've been informed that the race is the most challenging part of this game. Like, it's near on frustrating for some people. Apparently it was really frustrating in the original game too. Um... Which is kind of funny, so I guess um, 2K decided to keep that very accurate. Hmm, race day approaches, okay. Look at this half portion. Where were you last night? I was with you. You go on ahead, Tom. I'll deal with this mook. Oh, <laughs> he drove you home. Oh, yeah. Christ, that was some night. For you, maybe. Those broads, not so much. So that's a five, a six. A <laughs> hey, buona sera, Tommy. Hmm. So that's a five, a six, uh, along with what's All right, let's go over here. Hey, Titi Tommy. Big day coming up, right? right? You, you, you seen the race before? Uh, kind of hard to miss. Celieri isn't going to let Morello break his winning streak, huh? No, no, sir. Got to send him a message. So, tonight, we will borrow his guy's motor from the track. My friend Bobby is a guard. For a little dough, he'll show you where it is. Then look someplace else while you t -t -t turn the key. I like Bobby already. Sh sure. Then in there is this other guy, Lolo Lucas Bertone. You take the car to him down under the Ju Ju Giuliano Bridge. He'll, you know, tune it a little. Make the race tomorrow more, more, more interesting. Then I take the car straight back and Bobby can stop looking someplace else. But you gotta be quick. B -b Bobby comes off shift at 1.30 and then and, and, and the next guy, he's an ass. <laughs> Sweet. Oh, hey, hey, if you need somewhere to keep your m -m motor safe where no one can take them, feel free to use the garage. Carlo finally got around to clearing it out. Thanks, good to know. Open the garage to select a vehicle, okay. Okay, let's select a vehicle. Hmm. Ooh, different variants. Let's stick with a hard top. Oh wow, different colors, okay. Just stick with that. Let's go. Turn off the radio so I don't get into trouble. And... Oh. Yep. That's the handbrake. Let's go. I don't think it's that far, so we can still drive. Want to experience the night city. Oh, that was close. How do I, um... Oh, that's how you change the camera. Oh, that's, that's weird. Yeah, that's a little better. Get out the way! Uh, I didn't do anything. <laughs> Wasn't me. So I'm, I know this game isn't super long, so I think it's like only like 12 missions or so, but huh, it seems really good quality so far. I'm loving the story. 
And here we go. You Bobby. Yep. We can take your car to the garage. Place is empty. Any friend of Ralphie's a friend of mine. I mean, if you got the money, sure. Huh. All right, then. <sighs> Tomorrow morning, they start coming. Whole city. They smuggle in hooch. There's fighting. I hate it. Ah, come on. Name a better place to pick up a dame than this place this weekend. Don't get me started. <sighs> Things I've seen. Things he's seen. Okay, this is it. Okay, I always want to press Y to get out because of like GTA. <laughs> oh, even though it's telling me what to press, but you know, I'm blind as a bat. Here she is, 1929 Carazella C Series, best in class. It's a shame you got to wreck it. If they see this down the road, cops are going to ask questions. When they catch up, sure. Try to keep it one piece too, huh? So, I gotta be back from Berton by 1.30 before the next guy shift. Yeah, he's an ass. I heard. Hey, oh gosh. Alright, let's do it. Oh man, yep, this is not an easy car to drive. Braking is kind of optional, I guess. This is really wacky. Oh man, I mean, it drifts a lot. Is this the actual race, like, the, the one that's difficult to do, or is there more? Alright, alright, we got it, 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 we got it. It's all good, it's all under control. Oopsie. That, that was a... That was a... Accident! Didn't mean that to happen. Oh, here we go. Oh lord. Officers reporting a race car driving at speed through the city. Anyone else seen this? Yeah, no one else has seen this before. Leave them behind soon, don't worry. The guy's got the way in North Park someplace. Keep looking, he'll turn up. Oh, Lord, this vehicle is. We got him. Officers report they're closing in. The guy's got the way in North Park someplace. Yep, yep, yep. I'm away. I'm away. Oh, my Lord. Just testing the wheels. You're here. Tommy Angela. Lucas Bertoni. Oh, ain't she a thing of beauty? We don't have much time. Hey, I'm a fast worker. Sit tight. Mm. Hello, you. Well, he seems happy with the vehicle. <laughs> hey, she's done. Thanks, Lucas. I gotta get back before anyone catches on. Go easy with her. She's gonna misbehave. Hey, tell Mr. Salieri, I'm always available for this kind of work. I do stuff for a lot of people, but I always know where I stand with you guys. Hot cars, getaways. Anything for the right price. Let's just hope Celieri's guy wins tomorrow. For all our sakes. Okay. Drive careful. Bang straight. 
Oh, that's pretty slick. Is this thing gonna be be naughty now? Is it a naughty car? Oh, okay. The engine will overheat. Oh my god, this is uh <laughs> I guess I can't max out that bar or else it's gonna be bad for me. But so if I let off the acceleration it will drop it back to zero. Oh, oh god, it doesn't even drive in a straight line. Oh, this is horrible. Oh, at least the brakes work. That's good for me. Oh god, no. Uh, yep, 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 yep. Okay, time it. Ah! Woo! That was close. Why didn't I go under the bridge last time? Oh lord. Wow, this thing just drifts from side to side. Oh, the cops didn't notice me, but apparently they did. Oh gosh. This is wonky ass. Wonky ass car, man. Ah! No, 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 no. Oh god. <laughs> alright, 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 alright. Here we go. All officers, search is called off. Repeat, abandon search. Abandon search. That sounds about right. Got a minute to get there. Oh man. That is. There we go. Come on. Come on. You can do it. You're almost there. Go. Oh god. Yeah, this is really easy to drive. Not. Oh. I swear, I'm actually a really good driver. It's the car, it's the car. Okay, here we go. Oh, you're back. Thank Christ. Good to go. Drives like a jalopy. Okay, let's get out of here. Big day tomorrow. Sweet. <laughs> so Sam walks out of the bathroom, and I'm praying he's got a piece on him, because I'm not sure the bartender's going to hand over what he owes. And his two sons, they're inching closer. I can hear them cracking their knuckles. They're both seven feet tall, built like brick shit houses. What were you carrying? My dick. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. This crazy bastard, he waltzes out of the bathroom just starts pissing all over the joint. <laughs> really? What, he didn't call the cops? Nah. Sometimes you just gotta make them think you're crazy. <laughs> Tom, you got a moment? Oh. Sure, Frank. You've got a bit of a situation. Is the boss okay? Oh, yeah. It's nothing like that. Mikey Dunn, our driver. Some of Morello's guys roughed him up pretty good last night. Broke his arm, broke his jaw, sent him to the hospital. Jesus. Yeah, tough locker for Mikey. Anyway, you're going to race for him. Wait, what? Frank, Tom, I don't... There's a half hour before the starting gun goes off, so this is not a discussion. The Don wants to win, but more importantly, he wants Morello to lose. And you are our best wheelman. Otherwise, I'd be talking to someone else. Yeah. You got to do what you got okay, to do. Frank. Good. Rafi has the car gassed and ready. Get to the track right away. <laughs> They're like, well, shit. <laughs>
Uh oh. From Europe, we got the hot shot favorite, Martin Lichtenberg, taking some time out of the International Series to compete with us today. Got some news from the grid here. Lost Heaven local favorite, Mikey Dunn, is out. Replacing him is, uh... Tommy Andrew. Well, I'm sure you'll all join me in wishing him good luck. I'm all the way at the back. They're lined up on the grid. They're ready to start. Oh, here we go. They're off. Lichtenberg's in trouble. There's something up with this car. Lichtenberg is out. The favorite is out. Oh, this is fun. Oh. What? Oh god. Okay, this is what they said was difficult. Is this one? Oh lordy. I'm gonna get I gotta win this? Ah crap! Okay, okay, I can do it, I can do it, I can do it. What? Aggressive driving from Angelo. Yes. Yes, very aggressive. Ah oh, crap! Everyone's crapping out. Come on! You're kidding me! Why am I saying you're kidding? I'm in third. I'm in third. Ah! Oh. Yeah, it's three laps too, right? Come on, 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 go, 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 go. Ah, crap! Why do you keep saying crap? What's the, uh, have a camera angle like? Oh god, yeah, that's a little bit nuts. Hey everybody, look at me. Ah, crap, stop us in front. Right, so I just need to keep it smooth for now. Oh. Hopefully, hopefully he stays here. This racing too bad, it's not too shabby. This car handles terribly, but it's okay. Hey, I beat your horn. Newcomer Tommy Angelo is still out in front. Beep beep. Up close and personal with the back leaders. This race is far from over. Oh yeah, there we go. Smooth driving, slick driving, slick driving. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, 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 oh. Yep. Angelo is still out in front. Can he hold on? Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Only one more lap to go. After this one. Nope, nope, not long at all. Not long. Oh god, the camera shakiness. Try to turn in this thing, it just shakes so much. Rigs on your walls. Okay, here we go. Alright, I think we got it. Keep on. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, crap. Got it, we 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 got it. We're gonna nail it. We're gonna nail it. Whoa! <laughs> 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 oh, it's the car! 
car is still intact. The wheels are gonna fall off. <laughs> that doesn't sound good. Only me shining today, boys. Only me shining today. Do do do. -do. Yeah. Nice job, Tommy. Hey, Tommy! There's <laughs> our winner. Hey, Tom. Just want to thank you for stepping in like you did. I had six months rent riding on that race. I'd be homeless now if not for you. I just did what the Don asked, Lucas. Well, you gotta let me find a way to repay you. Stop by my garage when you get a chance. I might have a line on something that'll turn a buck for you. Sure. Thanks. Oh, nice guy. I knew you wouldn't let us down, Tom. You made us all a lot of money today. And Morello's gonna be picking up pennies off the sidewalk for weeks. <laughs> Hey, what about the European? He's probably wearing some cement boots by now, the poor bastard. Ooh. Here. You earned every dollar of this. Take your girl out somewhere nice. Thanks, boss. Up, boys? You got a girl, right? I don't want you blowing all that on booze and horse. Huh? Nah, but uh, maybe I'll buy my mom a new coat. <laughs> Good boy. Go get yourself a drink. Congratulations, big hero. Nah, just got luckies off. Well, I had my money on the other guys, so drinks are on you. Oh. <laughs> there. Now you're ready for the pictures. Thanks. And hey, when you're done celebrating, you might want to go find your buddy Polly. He's so drunk, he's gonna get hit by a parked car. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> I'll get him home safe. Let's have a little chat with her first. Holly and the rest of your pals have drunk through half my bar already. You found him yet? Oh, we'll find him. That's all for another year, folks. Track will be open until six. Please leave when requested. Congratulations, Capion. That win just put my daughter through another year at school, Tom. Hey, anything for the Coletis. Well, enjoy the moment. But the deal with Polly before he embarrasses himself and the family. I will not let the boss's day end this hour. You don't have to worry, Frank. I'll find it. Great race, champ. All right. Oops. I'm okay. asked by the LHPD to remind all racegoers that the sale and consumption of alcohol is strictly Great prohibited. An arrest will be made. Thank you. Great race, champ. Hey, last time I saw you drive like that, Tom, I had a gun to your head. You saying there wasn't one today? <laughs> when our side of town is drowning in dough, that means you're safe. Hey, you seen Polly? Guy soused. Came through walking sideways. Yeah, I heard. All right, so he's down here somewhere. Let eat Polly. What a character. you're here. If your friend keeps this up, the other guy's gonna send the cops over. Yeah, I think Polly's big day at the track's over. Yeah, come on, Polly. Cow says moo, and the chicken says quack. What does the bird say? I don't know, but the security guy back there says you gotta go home. That's an asshole. You should show some respect. What does the fox say? It's true, but I'm saying you gotta go home too, before you resurface the pit lane. Well, okay then. I guess. Let's go, Jim. <laughs> All right, buddy. <laughs> he is drunk off his head. Go, go, keep 
Pressing Y. You did real good today, Tommy, with the the driving. I was right. I was right when I found you. You know what I said? What did you say, Polly? I said this guy can drive, Don Salieri. This is a guy who can drive. And here we are. <laughs> here we are. Right here. That's where we are. You put me to shame, Tom. Look at you. Now you're even a some kind of race car driver. We all got our doing real good since you joined the family, but you know you got it easy, right? <laughs> Me and Sam, we keep the real stuff from you. That right, huh? You don't know what it's like. You get the call to see the Don and your minds race and done some bad shit, Tom. We're all in this together. I do what the Don asks when he asks it, just like you. You're like me, you can't just shut it down. Blank it out like Sam does. Go home to wherever the hell he goes home to. Bali, you're drunk. You're gonna have to clam up for your own sakes. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Oh, Polly. Tom, I want to get with the lady. Uh, I'm not helping you with that today. Take me to the ladies. Take me to the Blue Tropics. I don't know. I ought to take you home. The bridge. Take the bridge over to the island. Take me to the ladies. Take me to those sweet patooties. I don't know. Taking you home seems more classy. That it does. Need to look him out, look after him. Yes, Polly. Yeah. Maybe, maybe that's yeah, a good idea. <laughs> yeah. Well, okay, I'm gonna. Sweet dreams, tough guy. Uh, I'm gonna. Yeah, I. I don't feel so good. Oh gosh. <laughs> Sarah. <sighs> yeah, that's the cold thumb. You want anything else? Nah, I'm heading home. Hey, Tom, uh, before you go, I ask maybe a small favor. Huh? Sure, Luigi, what do you need? Walk in my daughter room. Sarah, the <laughs> way I hear it, she doesn't need any kind of escort. <laughs> She's uh, she's a tough. This is a pack of boys near her place. Uh, the punks, you know, cattivi ragazzi. They talk blue, make advances. Sarah, she's gonna speak at the mind. But maybe she says something they don't like. Things that get ugly. But if you working at home, this reminder these punks she's the dawn's a goddaughter. No problem, Luigi. I'd be honored. Benny. Sarah, the time is close. What a sweet guy. What's this then? Uh, Tom is. Uh, Tom's gonna take you. That right. Hey, I just work here. Make sure nobody bother you. Fine. If it'll make you feel better, Pop. Hey. I'll see you tomorrow. Let me get my coat. I'll wait for you outside. Oh, nice. Where, where's her coat? Is she wearing a coat? You okay? Oh, he's carrying the coat. I don't need anyone walking me home. Hey, we were talking about meeting up tonight anyway. I guess. And you can quit worrying about what he's gonna think. 
But not the point, Tom. He treats me like a kid sometimes. Hey, I get it. He's protective. He's seen things. We've all seen things. Well, we gotta talk about you stealing food. Hey, I cook it, so I get to say where it goes. <laughs> well, he won't thank you. Well, maybe tomorrow's finally gonna be the day he fixes his own breakfast. So that's a gentleman. Knock on the door. Only got so many hands here. Knock, knock. for me <clears throat> yeah though it's not as much as last time it's enough nona thinks you're an angel the dawn hates seeing food go to waste and this this has got to be tammy sarah told us all about you that right you're a famous race driver tom everyone talks about you yeah she's right they do no awkward at all well, anyways, don't let the cold in, Juliet. I'll see you at church. All right. Have a great evening. Night. Buena noche, family. Hey, Mama. Your angel Sarah brought more food. That's nice. It's nice you do that. That? Well, a lot of hungry people on this block. Yeah. Well... It's, um, uh, it's a good night for a walk, anyway. Don't get yourself killed on my account, Tom. I try to avoid it. <laughs> That's all you got? You spend all this time with a lady killer like Sam Trapani, and the best line you got is, good night for a walk anyways? <laughs> well, it is, ain't it? Yeah, I guess so. Slow down. Flowers for the lady, signore? Nah, we're good. Now I don't get flowers? When you let me take you on a real date and not some walk home for Luigi, then you get the flowers. Yeah, that could happen. If Pop's not gonna stop me seeing one of you, I think he knows anyway. <laughs> Luigi? Nah. These guys have been creeps to me for weeks. But I didn't tell you as I know what you like. I mentioned it to Dad this one time, and all of a sudden he gets you to be my knight in shining armor. So yeah, he knows. Huh. Well, like I say, means there's no problem with me. If he did, you wouldn't last long. I know what happened to all the other guys I dated. I helped hide the bodies. <laughs> ah, so now we are... I've been trying to keep you safe, Tommy Angelo. All this time. Let's go someplace. Tomorrow night, maybe. The pictures, maybe. You can get your flowers. That'd be good. Oh! Hey there, darling! Are you stepping out on us? Piss off. <laughs> Don't cast the kitten, doll face. We'll let your boyfriend watch. What do you say? We going to have trouble here. Trouble started back when you tried to steal our girl, Chief. You saps aren't careful. You'll end up in wooden overcoats. <laughs> Ooh, I like it. Last chance to walk away. We ain't frails. We know who you work for. Salieri might have been the big six when he was younger, but he's all washed up now. Mm -hmm. It's only a matter of time before Morello punches his ticket. <laughs> I don't need Salieri. Or anyone else. Not for this. <laughs> well... <laughs> Then let's see what you got, cake eater. Mm. Oh, okay. Your corner, sweet cheeks. Okay. What I... That's right. You're some kind of dish, ain't you? I've forgotten how to get fight, apparently. <laughs> Twist like hey. this uh. on that grease. Uh. Me and Johnny here, we can do this all day. Huh? You even touched <laughs> in your face. <laughs> 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 oh. You need a real guy. Uh. Oh my god, why can't I? Ugh. 
Come on. Oh, the camera's are wonky. And out. And down he goes. Get away from me! Get away. Uh, uh, Scumbag. Oh, okay, that worked out. Tommy! Who's this asshole? My turn now. Hope you're better than your friends. Do I, uh... Oh my god, I can't not block. Oh my lord, I am... Combat is kind of wonky in this game. I'll give you that. You're bleeding. Come up to my place. I'll take a look. And they're all out for the count. Well, you gonna come in and take a load off or what? I'm wondering when you'd invite me up. You had to get stabbed for it, though. Thanks, closed slugger. I'm just gonna patch you up, is all. Now go sit down on the couch, roll up your sleeve. I'm getting my sewing kit. Doesn't look too bad. You need something for the pain? No, I'm fine. You don't have to do that. What? I can see it fucking hurts, Tom. You wanna pretend it don't go ask Polly to staple you up. What do you get? Compliments of the Dan. Take another. All right. You're going to grin and bear this? Yeah, I'll be okay. Good. Cause I don't need the little old lady next door complaining to the super about all the racket. Just be quick about it, will ya? Oh, it's gonna take as long as it takes. The sloppier the stitch, the uglier the scar. They're right. You stitched up a lot of fellas. Just my father. And I would really go after Luigi sometimes. He got pretty good at ducking dinner plates. So one day she stabbed him with her knitting needle. Right through the hand. What for? Cause she was an ugly, jealous drunk. There. Not my best work, but it'll hold. The scar would be something to remember you by, if nothing else. <laughs> You're staying over. Can't have you stumbling through the neighborhood pie-eyed. Not when them hoods are out looking for you anyways. Yeah, okay. You got an extra blanket or something? No. And the heat's out. Ho, ho, ho!
Is the heat really out? <laughs> this helped though. Aww. Well, that was a very quick little chapter. I like that one. That was good. Yeah. This can't stand. Sarah's okay, boss. I took care of it. She started working here before she could see over the bar. I don't have a daughter of my own, Tom. I'd do anything for Luigi's little girl. So would I. We all would. That's right, boss. Anything for Luigi and Sarah. Do those bastards think this is fucking Luna Park or something? I'll rip them apart with my own hands. Our business is protection. But who's gonna pay up when they learn we can't even protect one of our own as she walks home from work? So what do you want us to do? Teach these boys a lesson. Break every bone in their bodies. Put them in wheelchairs. Bust their faces up so bad, even their mothers can't look at them without screaming. We know where they're holed up. My friend on the force says we should start looking into Chinatown. Then Big Biff will know something. Tommy, go to Vinny, get us some gear. Meet me at Biff's place. Yeah, okay. Leave these punks laying in the street. I want everyone to know we do not allow mad dogs to run wild in our neighborhood. You got it, boss. Some of these sons of bitches could still be on our turf. I'll check the neighborhood. Make sure they're gone while you see Biff. Good hunting. Yeah, same. Okay, so when you're done with Vinny, come find me in Chinatown. Sure. Let's go bust some heads. And busting heads is what we'll do in the next episode. So, that's it. That's it for today. Got through two chapters. And I look forward to seeing you all in the next episode. Please do not forget to smash the like button, hit subscribe, and the notification bell to receive more updates on future episodes from me. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you very soon. I have been a non-professional gamer. That is a wrap.